Okay, music theory students, welcome to another installment of Species Counterpoint 1 studies. And right here in front of you, you have an example of good student work in the form. We are in the key of C minor, and here is our cantus, the lower line, in alto clef. C minor has three flats in it, B, E, and A. And here's your tonic tone. Let's take a listen at the cantus. In order to compose a good counterpoint above the cantus, you need to analyze the, the, the cantus that you're given. And I note that he labels measure six as the climactic moment in the cantus, which is scale degree five in the key of C minor. The note on measure five, the A flat, is actually higher than this, but really isn't the climax. It functions as an upper neighbor to the climax. And notice how above it, in his counterpoint, he doesn't create a climactic moment, but actually winds down and lets the cantus take over as, as its um, in, important moment to shine. And he does reserve measures four and nine for the climactic moments, where he hits his G naturals, respectively, which is its scale degree five in the key of C minor. Okay? Let's take a look at the counterpoint that he adds above the cantus. One more time, another playthrough. Okay, you'll note the use of parallel tenths from measure one to two. He leaps down in his counterpoint, the cantus leaps up. Here's a very delicate situation when you're heading into the use of double skips, but he makes it possible by skipping no more than a third in his counterpoint. At the same time, the cantus skips no more than a third. And also, these skips of a third are inward in contrary motion. And additionally, he's skipping between a tenth and a sixth. And those are the, the three components that are needed in order to have a smooth double skip, if you're going to use it. Then finally, he proceeds in contrary motion, leaps up to scale degree five, which has a lot of tension, but knows he has to wind down and head back up to five to create a true climax. And he approaches it by step. Let's take another listen. Some other things that I note, notice how he raises scale degree seven as he concludes the exercise. Again, in minor, you need to raise the leading tone as you rise to the tonic. Again, this cantus descends down to the tonic, so his counterpoint needs to ascend up to the tonic. And those would be your six-eight endings. A lot of good work in this example, a lot of good work.